Are you struggling with dark circles and puffiness? Are fine lines and wrinkles rearing their ugly head? Well, in today's video, we're going to make green tea eye cream. This recipe is full of anti-inflammatory and emolliating properties, reducing eye puffiness, lightening dark circles and skin spots, and deeply moisturizing for a beautiful, even, and glowing complexion. All right, let's get to it. Please like, share, and subscribe. One four ounce glass mason jar. One ounce of green tea. Green tea is filled with anti-inflammatory properties due to their polyphenols, calcagens. The cations in green tea can help reduce irritation, redness, and swelling. It's also full of vitamin B2 and vitamin E, which can support in maintaining collagen levels, helping the skin to retain its structure and firmness. Vitamin E also supports new skin cell growth. The caffeine and tannins in green tea can help decrease the blood vessels around the eyes, helping to reduce puffiness and dark circles. 1 teaspoon of rosehip seed oil. Rosehip seed oil helps exfoliate and brighten skin tone and can boost collagen formation. It helps reduce dark circles under eyes, scars, and fine lines. 2 ounces of sweet almond oil. Almond oil is full of vitamin E, vitamin A, essential fatty acids, proteins, potassium, and zinc. It's very gentle and safe for almost all skin types. Due to almond oil's anti-inflammatory properties, it can lighten dark circles, skin spots, and reduce under-eye puffiness, giving the skin a fresh and healthy appearance. Almond oil also contains emollient properties, which can improve both the complexion and skin tone. It's also deeply moisturizing, not only softening the skin, but can reduce scars. 1 teaspoon of vitamin E oil the antioxidants in vitamin E can promote healthy blood circulation. It can slow down the skin aging process and make your skin look firm and youthful. It is also an excellent moisturizer, reducing and preventing dry skin. It can help strengthen skin barrier function and may act as a natural anti-inflammatory, soothing and calming the skin. 1.5 ounces of shea butter. Shea butter is a zero to one on the comedogenic scale meaning its ability to clog pores is very low. It's a deep moisturizer and can reduce inflammation. One ounce of beeswax. Beeswax is also very moisturizing and can reduce inflammation. Essential oils I like to use is 10 drops of frankincense, five drops of rosemary, and five drops of ylang ylang essential oil. Frankincense is antibacterial, can boost the immune system, and support cell regeneration. It can increase concentration and focus, reduce stress and anxiety, and supports against inflammation. Rosemary is also antibacterial and can promote improved blood circulation. Its antioxidants can help prevent wrinkles by stopping free radicals from breaking down the skin's elasticity. Ylang Ylang supports against inflammation, promotes blood circulation, and is full of skin soothing properties. Boil water in a double boiler, or you can place a pot into a larger one filled with about 1 to 2 inches of water, and add 2 ounces of sweet almond oil. Then add 1 ounce of green tea to oil. Let mixture heat until the oil is at a low simmer. Next, add mixture to a small bowl and let cool for 3 hours. Then, strain the oil through a cheesecloth. This oil should make one ounce of green tea infused oil, which you will need for the recipe. Add 1.5 ounces of shea butter and one ounce of beeswax to your double boiler. Then add one ounce of green tea infused oil, one teaspoon of rosehip seed oil, and one teaspoon of vitamin E oil and stir. Once entire mixture is melted, remove from heat. When the oil mixture has cooled, add the essential oils. Add mixture to a four ounce glass mason jar and let harden. You can also place in the fridge for quicker results. It's just that easy. Here's the recipe if you'd like a screenshot. Store the eye cream in a cool and dry space. Thanks for watching, and remember, like, share, and subscribe for more wellness content at The Essential Journey, restoring the mind, body, and home with the power of nature.